In this video, we show a new module based on the OpenKN document management system. It is an electronic document exchange module for organizations, uh, which allows creating a secure channel of communication between several companies, such as an agency and its clients. Thus, the agency can exchange documentation with its clients, and they, in turn, use the exchange module to send their documents to the company. To see the module, we are logged in as a client. When accessing the application, we see a list of documents. In the list of news, the new content made available to the client stands out. At the top, the client has access to the application menu. In documents, we can access the list of files available in the module. These contents are public. This means that they are housed in a public folder where the client can serve over the repository. We can preview the files and download them if we want. In Inbox, the client can send documents to the company. In this case, we see that the client has already sent a file to the agency, which we could download and even delete it if necessary. New is that appears by default when the client logs in, in which the client sees the latest documents that the company has provided, where we can preview or download them. And remove them from the news list if we want. In search, the client can search and therefore find documents stored in public folders, that is, in the folder that the company is sharing with its client. Here, we can see an example of a search where the client can identify the file thanks to the zoom mail, and for more information, we can access the location of the file within the module where we can preview or download it if necessary. As an electronic document exchange administrator, we can manage the client portfolio with access to the application. Here we see how the administrator can create a new user. Each user is assigned a type of user. along with their login password and email in which they will receive notifications and communications and of course in the same way that we create users within the module we can delete them when we need it in this example we see how we have a folder per, per client. Within each client folder, there are two subfolders, one for the inbox and another public folder. In the public folder are all the documents that the company shares with the client. The organization can create private subfolders, which are not accessible to the client. And in the inbox, the company receives the documentation that its clients provides.